Good day, lords and ladies, and welcome back to Wild of Myth from Ecornus Knight and a new story. Now, as you can see here, 45 townsfolk survive. The town are doing something with the missing townsfolk and attacking the stronghold to distract them and maybe allow more townsfolk to be rescued. But the longer it would take, the more time. Okay. So, we need to grab some resources as quickly as possible. But let's go. Um. Heartwood and fabric. I'm going to go more heartwood. Let's go. So another person's just died. We got that station. Let's go here and scout. Yes, yeah, going down 42, 41. Okay, so that's the dragon folk. Hunter. Right, if we don't go now, we're going to lose too many people. So we need to go and scout it. Thirty seven. Yeah, we had to take it now. Like we've lost a lot of people. I didn't realise this was up here ticking down. Right. Let's go. Instead sort of take what we have. We've lost, so far we lost, let's see, seven people. Buried near Galen's library is a thing that the Muffman called a grim scene. Here's another mark. A grim scene is a physical place where this world remains stitched to another. It can be used for crossing over. We are aiming for real masswoods now. Don't open your mouth to widen there. Frogs and wrens jangle their voices, safe amongst the reeds, otherwise the area is creepily quiet. But a grim scene is quite fragile, Ex extreme care will be required to fit the whole fit whole humans through. So there lies your hope, wherever the Fraxil is doing with your people, separating them all to the terra um, fract. I can only guess, but it's likely slow, slow work. Trees packed wetly in, the stink of putrid plant matter fuels thick in in no noses, summoning snot, puddles of mucus like muck among the roots roots and blog and quiver. Wouldn't mistake that for a tox dent. A, a rotten hole at the base of a tree twists into into fetching darkness. Morfan said it was a couple of ways down. Well, Dane and I could find another mud pit to slide in. Maybe that'll confuse them a little. Watch out for their for her hero moves, yeah. Hmm. Anyway, this gives the prisoners a better chance. Plus five survivors. Let's do that. Yeah. Recruit some of our losses. Borley and Dane pick a squishy patch, trying to keep their steps on spongy wood and trusted stones. They soon discover a sticky stairwell in the overground foundation of some forgotten structure. Hearly, hearing Borley's sag signal, both parties begin the descent. Feeling al alone, close, g feeling along close, gunky walls, ducking through wet curtains of lacy mould. To wherever's waiting below. Okay. Get warding, get speed. And that's a lot of enemies. I take it because we took so long to get down here. Unrested one, unresting one, unresting one. They pull along the remnants of their humanity, oddly, oddly odors moving at a surprising speed. Yeah. Where's the rest of my party? 
Okay, so they're up here. Okay. They have to come to me, these ones. They can see us. So let's try... And... Can I get to here? Problem is if they move and see us, because they're going to be all in this chamber. What's this? Is this the door reacting because I'm standing on it? Okay. Let's take this nice and quietly. The thing is, if I move too close to them, it will trigger their um, alarm unless I kill them in one turn. Okay. Let's infuse... I can't infuse anything that close. Okay. So they're patrolling. Nope, they know we're here. We need to go. Yeah, we need to go right now. Where is she? Yeah, we need to bust out of here. Like Jiminy Cricket. Okay. Okay, that's a lot. Okay. Get Guardian up. These guys are going to be annoying as anything. So let's get you up here. So who's got fuses on? You can only shoot him. Okay. We could flare. Discus could probably kill that one. Wouldn't do anything against that one, though. Um, yeah, let's infuse... Bone Lance. Yeah, Bone Lance. Bone Lance that. That's not going to work. Is there anything else we can get? That, but that flare won't do anything. Especially since it blocked it. I wish I could shoot that, but you can't shoot possessed objects. Attack scenery. That's still going to hurt. Dang, didn't kill it. Didn't kill that one either. Ok, 
Okay. Still got Bone Lance, right? I thought that was going to crit hit. It's not going to be enough to kill it either. Not enough to get through its armor either. I need to kill these things as quickly as possible because they're becoming a real issue. Um. This guy's a massive threat. Okay, we need to bust out of here. This is really dangerous to be in. Especially for the enemies that are turning up. That won't kill nearly enough people. Um, flare. You could get these two and then make a run for it. Have to kill off this one, though. Curse as I ended my turn. Well, these guys are coming. And they need to die. It dodged. I didn't really want it to take that dodge. Her ward held. But her armor's just got shredded. Yeah, that's bad. We need to leave. Because her, her stuff is getting shredded. Yeah. Yep. Okay, 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 okay. Um, that guy's dead. Discus, Bone Lance. Okay, let's get up here. I need to kill this guy, really. Okay, we need to go. We need to go right now because he does not have the energy levels to be standing, staying here. Um, this guy has to die as well. Um, we could do a compulsion on him to move him out of the way. Infuse with... Flare might work. Grab might work. Problem is, discus isn't, discus isn't going to do enough. Um. Okay. Can you kill him? If you kill him and get there, uh, there's no way for you to do any damage to this thing. No, because you're out of range for that. Okay, so it's better for you to kill that one. And then to make a run for it, probably. Because even if I can pulse and you're still going to be in range, it's better for you to get over here out of the way. You, on the other hand, are in for a world of hurt, and I don't think there's a lot I can do about it. You're going to get up here. Could shoot him. Could kill that thing off, which would be a benefit for me. There's one last thing taking attack actions. That's annoying. Okay. 
first things first, you need to get fall back out of here because you're in a really bad location. No way we can hit anything there. Um, you need to fall all the way back to here, really. Right. Hit them. You could hit that. Hit that and get rid of it, maybe. We could do this. Discus that. It missed, which sucks, but it gets rid of its cover so we can shoot straight through. Move up here and stab it. These things need to die really quickly. The amount of magic they're putting out is annoying. Yeah, that's infusing the flames. I don't like that. Okay. So let's do Bone Lance. A lot of them dodged, which is annoying. Um... If I got left in my powder kit in my play box, could come here and infuse. What's this? Bone lance, another one. Grab. There we go. That was a nice solid hit. With that done. Who can we get an insta kill off? Okay, if we get here, you can attack either of those. Okay, so we can kill this one. This one hasn't got a link to anything. That one has a link to that fire. Let's kill that one. Stab it, those buggy things are becoming a pain. Okay. Yeah, I need to. It. Oh, I keep on dodging. It's so annoying. Okay, so, Mage is up first. What can we infuse? We can't infuse anything useful, unfortunately. Okay, unless this guy dies. Let's first kill off... Guaranteed kill on him. And the bug is really annoying. I suppose what we could do... Okay, so we got her. Got another Bone Lance, but Bone Lance won't do a hell of a lot. Maybe enough to, to smash through him. I mean, if you get... Get to there and then fire a blast of fire down. That would probably do some damage. Don't know what that does. Okay, so that's toasting them. 
they're going to die from the fire this turn pretty sore. If not, I can guarantee a kill. Um, this one needs to get slashed up. Let's see what's going to happen to that one. Um, the problem is if we kill, like this one's like on full health, which we can't do a lot about. I might actually, what I'm going to do is I'm going to pull back with her to here. You're going to kill this one. Because it's guaranteed. That's going to take fire damage and die off. She took a hit from the ward, but her ward armor protected her for most of it. Okay. Okay. You can attack that guy. Can't do. A, they have a lot of physical armor, and they just keep on blocking. And there's. Uh, I just can't... I just cannot hit them. At all. Um, it is really starting to become a pain. We could do... An infusion on that for our bone lance. We could do... Actually, what we could do... Let's take her over the fire. And we'll do... Fire Lash. Onto this one. Which will burn through some of its stuff. Um, we can go. Fire last onto that fire. Fall back. And then we go. Fire last onto you. You're hurt. You're not looking anywhere nearly as healthy as I would like. And the thing is, I'm having to be really careful with this person because obviously... Yeah. Her armor's just got shredded. Okay, they're all in the position I want them to be in for now, because we've got to counter-attack. We've got to counter-attack hard. Right. So. I'm going to do compulsion on this one. And get it to stand in the flames. Okay. With it standing in the flames, I'm going to go and fuse on this patch of fire. We're going to do Fire Lash him. You're going to get here and kill that one, which gives you some temp HP. You're going to shoot this. You're going to do a nice solid block, bunt damage. He's stunned one turn. We need to get that stun off. I thought the fire would have killed it. It was standing in the fire. Why wasn't it why didn't it get killed from the fire? Okay. Man, that's really annoying. It walked into flames. Why didn't it get burnt up? Okay. Yeah, I get it. Death Rattle. Okay. Okay. So that won't work. Let's... Too, uh, that's too close, you might get smacked. Uh, that's annoying. I just wasted that.
Yes, he's got a, he's getting absolutely hammered. I don't know what these rattle things are doing. Okay. Oh, he's got a ward up. Okay. Nice big hit. You need to get here. Kill that one. Problem is, I don't think I can get. Like, he's gonna have to go for the flames. Takes no damage because of the ward. And we stab that one in the face. Who? Leveled up across the board. More armor. Yeah. Level up. Excellent. Hobble isn't so bad. Reduces speed. I'm going to get viciousness for extra damage. Let's see what we want to put. Let's see what we can get. Sealed Barrow is nice. Once per turn. It's an active ability though. Though that gets rid of armor, which is nice. Untouchable. Untouchable is useful, actually. Sentinel is nice. Replaces Guardian. The warrior leaps two tiles in order to intercept three foes who who pass nearby, performing a reaction strike and stopping their movement. Aid is nice, because you get health back. I'm probably going to get Hade, actually. Because that means we can get healing up. Familiar faces float from the shadows where they hid. Uh, they change, grim, grimly hollowed eyes, they stare. But they are steam ray folk, and they are alive. We came as quickly as we could, can't help but feel sorry though. Dane addresses them. Wish we could kill those monsters twice, come on, you lot. Come on, you lot, can help those who can't... Cl can help whoever can't climb. Searching over human faces, they find just 42 people lost. Of 42 of the lost, but they are survivors. They clamber from the nests of rotting vegetation that have presumably been provided for them. Ah, Kali, you're... Here you are. Found some more? No one. No one go too far, too quick. It's still a swamp. It takes days of warm coaxing to crack the cold trauma that's frozen their fa on their faces grim, but it's a brave start. You'll be, you're, you'll be okay, Elise. You know who lied if you're. You'll know who lied if you're not. You can smack me. I'm just worried about my big sister. See, I think I think she's dead. Your sister's Eluna, right? She and I had classes together sometimes. Hmm, that's her. They took her away like the others, but she never took her up the tunnel. No, it. There was a, it was like a door made out of spider string. It was like they wove it, kind of, in the air. It appeared and it went somewhere else, I don't know. But they took people through, one by one. They, everyone seemed to want to go. Sounds like the glimpsery, like what the Mothman said. Think that's what must have, it must have been. They called it the door, Elune and the older kids. People go through and they come back once time has passed and except they look like monsters then they wouldn't talk no one should go through that certainly not one of your age to see it uh, but Lune was the last one to take and she's been gone a lot longer than the others and never came back so anyway I'm pretty sure she's dead I mean I hope she's she didn't but then I also think it might be better if she did because she wouldn't want so, so I understand, but you know, we're avenging her. We'll keep avenging her as long as they keep coming. Okay. 
If I reach the edge of the wooded mast, music, musical yips of the wild of a wild fox greet them, echoing into the wild. Milk gold suns, milk gold sunshine coats the world. It smells, it smells so good all of a sudden, doesn't it? I should also, I mean, I should also, I mean, see, ask me to say thank you. We tried to escape, me and Eluna. We did try, but they caught us, thinking, thank you for coming to get me. You proved my sister right. Break track towards home. Later searches only stir the bones. If someone called, if something called the Glimsery existed here, it seems beyond human access. No sign of the girl's sister appears. Townsfolk rescued. 42. Plus three legacy points, plus one health to the company, plus one potency to the company. So I wonder if we can get, we can save more people if we get more legacy points. Okay, so we get resources. Four years pass. Yeah, see, infested tiles remaining. Um. So they leave, lose one. Yeah, man, this campaign is rough. You're losing hardly any cards. Okay, during the years of peace, seasons passed slowly under town with Storm Wraith. Hurtful reminders where everything em where everywhere empty homes, graves for missing bodies, classrooms full of ghosts. But human resilience is remarkable. Our great gift for smiling at the simple heated sunshine will bless whoever's left account. The wood that came out of Faze Lumberyard had a unique sheen, and it looked like it, and it looked at it in the bright light. It seemed to glow from within. It was especially popular in wands and staffs. Vizar finally translated the mist within one of one six scholars' quest to explain the origins of the Grey Plain. Unfortunately, Eva Vizar wasn't quite brilliant enough to understand until it was utterly raving nonsense. Cali, sorry, Sally noticed that the theatre. Harold Paul had fallen into repair during the con or the conflict, so she passed the summer helping to rebuild it. El Nina added a new addition to her onto her house. There was just something about having a dedicated research room that boasted productivity. Dwayne was visited once by a man cloaked in ivy. The spirit lay out three features futures for Dane to pick from after carefully deliberation, one was finally picked. The town rarely slept before midnight. They told me I should check on you. You said you. Were, I said you were fine. What? What? Second, I don't smile. I have a crisis. Nah, just remembering some kids we knew. Starlight, mirror, um, mirrored lamplight, and the vigil seldom slacked. So we can transfer her further. Loses speed, gets more block. Um. No, thank you. So her other arm goes up in flames. Um, right arm, action, flaming strike, plus two to six to nine magical damage. No, I'm not going to take that, to be honest. Um, okay. So, we have supplies now. First things first. I can't actually... Man, that's annoying. Um, yeah, I would have really liked to have this bow, but the problem is I need to up because like her spoon is not cutting it, and she needs to have a wand, which is going to take heartwood. Um, even if I just give her a stave, it's going to take heartwood. So yeah, this is the situation I have, which is that I don't have enough heart. I don't have any heartwood, not really to speak of. And I need it for multiple characters. The thing is, my ranger, who primarily uses a bow, um, really needs to have a decent bow. But that's going to take a lot. It's not going to take. It's just the heartwood it's going to take. So we're going to give it to her, which is painful because. I mean, we can give her a basic wand with the one heartwood.
I mean, she has an axe. But the thing is, she has fire blot, and the sister doesn't actually have anything, so let's give her that. That takes care of all the heartwood, unfortunately. She needs to have better gear. Right. Problem if I do that, that's going to eat up a lot of my fabric. Give her actual proper armor. I'll move her up into that. That would be nice, actually. More armor, more dodge chance, more stun chance. So that's basically an evolved form of that. Okay. I mean, we could even, to be honest, we could just get her straight up. Let's give her that. But she has a lot of armor already. Um, no. I'm going to go... Right. Because I don't think I can get her a better weapon now. Besides maybe an improved dagger. Um, so let's get her this. Because she's still relatively young. She can't have that. Yeah. So we could get, I'm going to get her this to boost her armor up, and her spell damage goes up slightly. And with what we have left, which is just ingots and thread, really, I don't think we can buy anything else. Um, besides basic stuff. I mean, I could get her dagger, but that puts her spell damage down. Um, not a fan of that, to be honest. If I had some stuff left over, I would have maybe gotten something like that for increased warding. Okay. Only thing I can do is, but the thing is, I'm never going to use that sword, so it's just a waste of me of resources for me to switch it out. Okay. We did all all right. I'm not particularly happy. There is wisdom that survives from grandmother's times. Never trust a dream you dream in the moonlight. Take care if you lie under the window cast. Every gap, gap as slender as a moonbeam. Even a gap as slender as a moonbeam will omit a skilled weaver's needle. It's black here. In the dark between book and shelf. But oh. Trillium moon. You don't seem real. An eye opens. Ease up. I'm only saying so. Bet I own, I'm out on the ocean behind the bookcase. Bawley's going to expect me to wait for her. But come on, we do too much waiting already, too much pulling on our wrists and slit, sitting on our, on our hooks. Oh hey, there's... There's something out... Something, there's someone out jumping on the waves. Watch out, that's danger. The figure falls for the hole in the sifting waters. That's dangerous, I tried to say. Am I the only one who can do something? The sheep certainly won't help. Vaguely, vaguely, vaguely their creature. 
So Callie hops over the wool mist sea and looks at the hole. Drips limb by limb into the darkness. And now she's inside a saddle cell where odorless lamps emit little more than haze. Who who are you? I'm who I'm who's having the dream. Is that Sally? Sally Yarn? Sally suddenly recognizes the young woman Eluna. Eluna Arts right? How vivid this seems. It's, it's like it's seeing I'm seeing you again. You are. How'd you get here? Do they know? Well, you're in my dream. Dream? You keep saying you're dreaming. If you're not one of their tricks, if you're calling, if you're really Sally Yarn, maybe you got here through dreaming. Do you know what happened to my little sister, Elise? We found her. She's safe. She's safe? Not many were as lucky as her. This feels too real. Where, where we're meant to be? Somewhere else, these bug things brought me through the, their world and ours. There's this, it won't make sense, but it's like her. From beyond the dim door, a drone enters the room, distant, a drone enters the room, distant light grows. Trouble? The noise vibrates in every uniform stone. Sally, if you leave here, you need to do it. They're going to find you, and I don't know if... How do we save you? We'll come to get you out. Actually, I, what we need to find is another one of those Glinsley, right? They'll sense a threat and you won't ever get close. My sister's strong. Tell her I... Can you be sure they detected us? Well, I, the longer I've been here, the more it seems to have some obvious perception. The sense attuned to the forces inside things, their essence or whatever they call it. A group of your a group of you would be like thunder to them. You'll be throwing your lives away for a person who's been gone so long. I I can barely remember Edie's face. I'll come alone then. The dream begins to fade. Sally Sally wakes from her wandering sleep. She holds a clear idea in her mind, like a kernel of light that can draw her over the hills to wherever she must go. Several days pass before she is missed. Her trail eases, her trail easy enough to follow. Her note, her note wasn't chasing a dream of a girl who's been missing for how long. Something set her off, I guess. I don't know, but it feels a little like a little, a, a little like four years ago. Right. So we are back on the world map, and we're going to put a cut in here. We need to clear out this location. My goodness, yeah. We need to clear out this location. Got to clear out a lot of locations. But that's for next time, folks. I've been calling tonight. This has been Wilder Myth, Elena, and uh, Elune. I think it's like Elune and the Moth is called. Um, this is a new story. And I'll see you all again next time. Goodbye.